So I can still press my fingers in about a half an inch. It's way too early to start thinking about putting a power trowel on it yet. Probably 55 degrees right now, between 30 minutes and an hour before I'm gonna put a power trowel on this. It's firm enough so, you know, I, I shape my doorways, I get my edge in, I can go around and bag my edges, just, it's early, but I can still get all that stuff done just to stay ahead of the game, but got a little while yet before we get a power trowel, and that's how you check it right there. Press your fingers in. I wanna be able to press down on the surface of this, All right, get the power trial ready. I I got float blades for this. The, the float blades are, for, are like mag floating. They're like you use for the first hit on the concrete. Then we take them back off and then take them back off and then we use the finished blades, which are like a steel trial. So if you're using combo blades, that's perfectly fine too. Those basically just clip on over like that. Pretty easy to use. barely sinking at all maybe a sixteenth of an inch from stepping on it so if it was if it was middle of the summer it was 75 80 90 degrees I'd probably be hitting it right now because it's only about 55 60 I'm gonna give that just a couple more minutes All right, so that felt just about right. Um, perfect for first float. What I might do is because it's kind of cool today is I might just leave those float blades on and hit it a second time just to tighten it up even more. kick these blades off and I'm gonna go around the edges with my finished blades the edges are a little dry so I could put this up on the crane take them off or just pick it up and slide them off like this for the doors now let's go back and finish hitting what we floated before it gets too firm because we we got to smoothen that out float blades tend to leave the surface pretty open pretty rough we don't want to wait too long before we get it closed up
Uh, you can see how it's much smoother that gets with just one hit of the steel blades. So we'll give that, since all the sun's drying pretty good now, we'll give it 15 minutes probably. All right, it's been about 15, 20 minutes. All right, baking out in the sun. Let's hit it again. looking good the sun's really warming it up out there probably give it another 15 20 minutes that should be done all right this should be the last hit giving it about 20 30 minutes since the last time gonna buzz over it if everything shines out it'll be done we'll pick the trial up with the crane get our saw out get our saw cuts in we'll be out of here so let's see what happens Yeah, as you can see, it, it shined out really nicely. You can start to see and starting to turn black a little bit on the surface. That means it's done. It's perfectly shined out, perfectly smooth. All right guys, that's it. How to finish the garage floor, how to saw cut your contraction joints. It's the whole package right there. Thanks again, we'll see you on the next one.